guys, KFJ Explorers here. Today on this adventure, we bring you to the abandoned Mother Guerin High School alongside the abandoned Holy Cross High School. So this school opened up in 1962 as an all-girls religious school, and then eventually in 2004 it became co-educational. The Holy Cross side was then used for the boys, and the Mother Guerin side was used for the girls. Over time, however, the school started losing money and they had to close down the Holy Cross side, using only the gym for sporting events. Eventually, the whole site became abandoned in March of 2020 due to lack of student enrollment and lack of school funding. And then this building is soon to be demolished, uh, demolition beginning in July of 2021. So to start off this adventure, we'll be going into the Mother Gear inside, which was used for the girls first. And that side has everything left behind and features a gym, an auditorium, a chapel room, band room, art room, and a bunch of other classrooms as well. Um, so then following that explore, we'll be heading out and then coming back one week later to see the Holy Cross side, which was used for the boys. That side has the nicer of the two gyms, which is much larger. Uh, it also has a weight room and it also has a wrestling room with the mats left in it, which is my favorite part of the whole explore because I'm a wrestler. Um, so following that, we'll be heading back into the Mother Gear and Girls side uh, just to see how much the demolition crew has stripped out of the building in just one week. Um, and then following that, we'll be heading back six months later when the demolition begins on the first building. So if you'd like to follow along with the demolition of this school, I'll be making a separate video in the future, uh, just following along the demolition over time. So stay tuned for that as well. And yeah, without any further hesitation, let's explore this abandoned high school. Alright guys, so we just made it into this Catholic high school now, and right over here we have the school's chapel. Yeah, the basement's so fluffed. That's so gross. It's like yellow water. Yeah, probably. Pink bathroom. Yeah, so right now we just made it into the main part of the school. Alright guys, so right here we just made it to the auditorium of the school. <laughs> no, you're good. Wow. Here's the stage of the auditorium. Wow. Oh wow, so over in this section of the school, you could see where they're starting the demolition process and taking these out of the school. Yeah, and then there's a bunch of lockers out there too.
<laughs> Who's whipping this around? I'm trying to go up and see the top floor of the balcony and then head back down and see the rest. Yeah, this hallway has definitely seen better days. Yeah, and here we have the top floor of our auditorium. This is crazy. This is such a nice auditorium. It's huge. Such a big auditorium. Look how many people this would have sat. I'm gonna go head down and check out the rest of the downstairs of the school and then we're gonna head back up and check the rest of the upstairs. But real quick in the upstairs, you can see that this hallway is getting demolished. Everything's getting scrapped out of this before the building goes down. Real quick before we go down, we're going to be checking out the media center of the school. So this is like just the upstairs library. Wow. A lot of books left. Everything is still left behind in this media center. Wow, so right over here, oh, this is connected to the library. This would have been one of the tech rooms where they would have worked on like the students' computers and stuff like that. You can see also a bunch of stuff left in here. Oh, there's so many books in here, what the hell? All these books are expensive too. Like all these literature books and stuff. All right guys, so right here's the courtyard of the school. This is Pretty cool, I like the snow. The snow definitely adds to it. All right, we're gonna head back in and keep checking out the school, find the gym. Wow, guys, so right here's the gym of the school. This is so nice. Wow. Obviously, you could see that they're taking apart the flooring to demolish the building, but other than that, like, the floor is pretty much still whack. Like,
Oh wow guys, so right here is the dance room. <laughs> yeah, it is purple for sure. bathroom or the referee's bathroom depending on the day. Kitchen. All the cafeteria doors are locked. But here, if you look in there, you could tell it would have been a really nice cafeteria for sure. It's still set up. Mm -hmm. This would be the year before the last year, because their last year was the 2020 year. It was 2019 through 2020. It's the second to last year. Pictures right here. <laughs> The science rooms, these are always the best classrooms. Here we go. Wow. Still set up, floor is pretty much clean except for the front over there. Oh my God, it's a safety shower. Okay, so this would have been like the teacher's office and there's a bunch of chemicals in here. side of the hallway we have the same chemistry rooms or biology rooms but they're completely scrapped. You can see all of these are obviously where the desks would have been in. So it just shows the difference before and after what this building was gonna look like. God damn. First place in 1992 and first place in 1991. Wow, so these are like 30 year old trophies right here. Yeah, so this is Spanish, but we have Mr. Spanish speaker over here. He's telling us that the last school day was March 20th, 2020. It was on a Thursday. <laughs> Guys, so right now we're checking out the upstairs. We saw a couple, a little bit of it when we went to see the auditorium, but now we're gonna check out the rest of it.
That's so weird. Oh, they signed their name on this wall. Oh, there's a bunch of books in here too. Five Christmas trees right here. Here's some of the school's desks. I think these are the first desks we've actually seen. Oh, wow, there's a bunch of desks. Tardy for class. Oh, this is this room is so cool. Oh wow, look at this room. So much is left in here. I'd say definitely an art room. Oh, so these are literally art projects of students left behind. I like the McDonald's one. So this is just like another section of the art room that we were just in. And this is the band room. Oh my god. All right guys, so right here's the boys portion of the school. That's what we're gonna check out right now. Guys, we're back here day number two, one week later, and we just made it into the second building now. This is where all the boys would went to school. Here's all the doors of the glasses.
wow. So right here is a, a weight room. Not much, but some machinery left behind. Everything's cleared out over here. Over here is the kitchen. This is the concession stand for the school. Still got our mustards and ketchups. Wow, look at it. They have all the Gatorade bottles left. Home of the Gators. There's a bunch of signs left behind right over here on the bleachers. Oh wow guys, this is crazy. So right here is a wrestling room. And this is really unique to me because I actually wrestle. It's a pretty small wrestling room, but it's really nice. It has all the mats still, this is unreal. I've never seen anything like this and I've obviously always wanted to. This is awesome. So it says campaign to champagne because the uh, IHSA state tournaments in Champaign, Illinois at that building right there. Real quick while we're in the wrestling room, me and Tyler are gonna do a quick little demonstration for you. Isn't that right, Tyler? Yes, sir. He's excited. Obviously, was the locker room. All the lockers are stripped out. And over here are the showers.
Oh wow guys, so this right here is the trainer's office of the school. You can tell because those little tables over there. Wow, this is pretty cool. This is the coach's office. Still some cleats in here. But other than that, there's not much. Just this table, the uh, filing cabinet. Oh, this mirror would have been pretty cool, except for that dick on it. Over here in the hallway, we have some really nice murals on each side. We have one on that side. Got another one here. So right here would have been the front entrance of the boys' school. Welcome to Holy Cross. Oh wow, this room's huge. With a working piano. Is right back here is the football field of this high school. You can see whatever was right there is destroyed. All right guys, we just made it back into the girls' school. This is the much bigger one that we explored in the beginning. We're gonna see how the auditorium and everything's looking after a couple days of demo work. One week actually, a whole week. So right here is the chapel room that we saw last time, obviously. Pretty much the same exact condition. All right, so now we're back in the main halls of the school. So I think we're really just gonna go check up on the gym, check up on the auditorium, see, see the differences, see what the demo team did in one week. Wow, so all the chairs are still intact, but they uh, stripped down the red car or the red curtain. Yeah, so I mean, nothing really different besides the curtains being gone of the stage. Oh wow, so last time when we were here, there was a bunch of lockers and some machinery left right here, but they took all of that out of the school, along with all the lockers that we saw outside last time. Oh, the, lock the lockers weren't stripped in this hall, were they? I think that was just the upstairs last time. Could be wrong. Yeah, everything is way clearer than it was last time. Yeah, there's 
nothing left in any of the classrooms here. Oh wow guys, look at this. So the flooring is almost completely out there, just one little portion. As the last time when we were here it was like halfway. The gym is <laughs> the gym's in much worse condition than last time. They took a lot of flooring out. Yeah, look at that. Pretty much all the flooring of the whole room is now taken out. Pretty interesting to see like what it looked like last week versus just one more week. Oh wow guys, so our chemistry room is still here. It's pretty much the only room left intact. That's so weird. Danger asbestos. Wow, this is so interesting. Yeah, so they have all of it sort of blocked off, but we can still get in, obviously. So yeah, this is the upstairs. You can see now there's absolutely nothing. No lockers, no uh, flooring. There's just, it's literally just nothing. Everyone's popping out of the asbestos tunnel. <laughs> Trees are still here. Still had a bunch of books. Or not a bunch, it's um I love the asbestos tunnel. This is a <laughs> Oh wow, this one's a big tunnel. All right guys, so it's been about six months since we explored this high school um, and demolition just started at the bigger side, the girls' side. Um, so we're gonna go head over there and check it out. And uh, yeah, I think I could fly my drone as well. All right guys, that's gonna wrap up this high school. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. This high school was super cool and there's not gonna be many people to see it as it's gonna be demolished soon. Uh, be sure to go down there, subscribe, like, comment, and share this video with your friends. Also check out Tyler and Kendra down in the description below. Until next time guys.